for you. Our top story tonight, a man posing as a police officer tries talking his way inside of a Bloomfield Hills home. But when the homeowner refuses to let him in, the fake cop opens fire. The suspect shot through the front door, hitting that homeowner several times. And tonight, that gunman is still on the run. Southern Action News reporter Tara Edwards is live in Bloomfield Hills. Tara, what can you tell us about this investigation? Well, I can tell you that I spoke to the chief not too long ago, and he is not releasing a lot of details right now or the name of the victim because he doesn't want to hinder the investigation. But as you can see, the police are out here. They've been out here for hours investigating. This is in the 200 block of Woodwind Drive looking for. It's disturbing and unbelievable to those who live in the area. Someone posing as a police officer knocked on the door of this home around 1130 Wednesday night asking to enter the house. But the homeowner refused to let him in and threatened to call police. And that is when the fake cop fired shots through the front door into the home. Dr. Jerome Sittner's wife heard the noise. She woke up and she heard like she thought was two gunshots. Pop, pop. Uh, gunshots. Police say the gunman ran from the scene and got into a dark colored vehicle. The victim, who was hit by the bullets, was rushed to the hospital with non life threatening injuries. Detectives have been out here all day long digging for clues and searching for the gunman, who is considered very dangerous. Uh, it's very strange to happen in this type of neighborhood uh, to have two gunshots that somebody gets shot. And it's not clear if the gunman randomly chose this home, but we the victim is in serious yet stable condition. Reporting live, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.